Hey, I'm so sorry it took so long. I was looking for parking. No worries. It's so odd because when I was parking, there were like a lot of metered spots. Yeah, there was a lot of parking, um, but I kept going to the meters and I'd pay for it and it wouldn't turn the color green. So I kept going to like the next one and still it wasn't changing to the color green. So I just assumed that they were broken um, until I got to the fourth one and I realized it was Sunday. <laughs> Happens to the best of us. Well, it's finally nice to meet you. You as well. You mentioned earlier in our messages that you were going to the dog park. How was it? I did go to the dog park earlier. It was really nice. Um, I go to the one right over here off of Sepulveda. Uh, it's like right around the corner. And they have three sections actually. One for timid dogs, one for small dogs, and then the regular like large area for the more playful dogs. Oh, that's really good to know. Yeah, because um, I don't have a dog, but I might be getting one soon. So it's good to know that like there's one right around the corner. Um, what kind of dog do you have? Oh, no, yeah, I don't have a dog. Oh, so what do you do? at the park like is it just like a really nice park well it depends on what you define as a nice park it's like pretty fenced off um and like is solely for dogs but I'm a screenwriter so I go there when I have writer's block oh that's so sick do you write for dog shows or like puppy academy slash airbud type movie tv no, I do more um, reality television. I'm actually contracted um, by TLC, the network. Gotcha, gotcha. Yeah, parks, no matter if they're for humans, for non-humans, uh, recreation, non-recreation, they're a very tense and stimulating place. Like right now, those two people back there that are playing with a a ball. They're playing with what looks like a really heavy ball that could just like come at our direction at any moment in time. Um, and that really excites me. You know, it makes me think about the Titanic. Like anything can happen at any moment in time. And that's drama. I see. I see. I feel that. There's tension, and writing is all about really threading that tension. 